For a living, I work in the health and fitness industry. I manage a corporate fitness center. I work in financial services uh, for one of the banks in Canada. How did we find CrossFit? Um, there's a bit of a story behind that. Um, I started researching it. I was looking for something new and interesting. I was getting bored with the same routine. Fitness has always been a part of my life. You know, I'd go to the gym, I'd hit my chest day, my back day, my leg day, what have you. And I felt pretty good about it. Um, but Shannon, she's always someone that, uh, working in the fitness industry, would continuously try to challenge herself. Uh, and so when CrossFit came up, to me it was just another one of those uh, fitness trends like Zumba or Spin Yoga or Zimp Dip or whatever new trend, you know, is around the corner. And I talked to a few people and they said, why don't you try CrossFit? I said, oh, CrossFit, I don't know, people, they, it's like a little click or something like that, and I thought I would try it out, but I, I was skeptical for sure. But one day she called CrossFit Metric, and she ended up speaking to one of the owners there, Julian, and she comes home that night and says, this guy was so nice, he spent all this time with me on the phone, he explained all this, uh, you know, all the information about CrossFit, and he sounded like he was really knowledgeable, he knew what he was talking about. I just had a couple of questions in the beginning. But anyways, this guy actually like sounded like he knew what he was talking about. So I'm like, okay, let's go try it out. So I went home, told my, at that time, fiance about it. And he, 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 was, he was very skeptical, even more so than me. I was ready to go check out the club to stare down this Julian character and let him know who was top dog. But at the end of the workout, he was completely dead. He obviously had a very good workout. Um, I was sold right away, I'm not gonna lie. Um, so we got a week pass after that, and then after the second or the third workout, we were completely sold. We loved it. We loved the people, the atmosphere, uh, the programming. We loved that it was very different than your traditional routine. But when I went back to my, my household gym brand, uh, I, like the workout wasn't the same. I couldn't do it the same way. Like literally, I felt like, how, you know, how can I do chest day today after I just killed every part of my body the, yesterday at, at the CrossFit Club? So I kind of felt out of sync there. Literally, we went back to CrossFit Metric, traded in that five day pass that we had just purchased for an unlimited membership, and we haven't looked back since. Uh, working out as a couple changed the whole dynamic of our relationship. So uh, let me start by saying Yanni and I both worked out five, six days a week. Um, we both had a routine, but we both had a routine individually. We didn't train together at all. All of a sudden to be able to do it together is a whole different world. And I think that's one of the best parts of, of CrossFit, the community atmosphere, you know, whether you're a couple or not, but then as a couple, you're, you're challenging your, each other. You're coming in and the, the workouts are set up in a way where they're scaled. So, you know, it takes away the gender component of, you know, are men better than women in certain movements and women better than men in certain movements. So. I was always better than him. So, you know, he, I think I challenged him or at least I like to think that I challenged him. Um, like we, all of a sudden we had something to bond over. We talked about it, I don't know if that's good or bad, but we had something that we enjoyed together. So we did the same workout and later on we would talk about whatever, how I felt during the workout. What, what were your strengths? What were your weaknesses? You know, what you need to work on. I think we're competitive. Shannon is more competitive than I am, but we're competitive. Very competitive with Yanni. Uh, he's competitive with me too, but I guess in a, in a different way. Um, I think deep down he likes that I, I'm strong and that I can kick his butt in a wad. I let the scoreboard suggest that Shannon wins <laughs> more than I do. Whether that's actually the case or not, you know, this is bet footage between me and you, Shannon doesn't see this. <laughs> uh, but, you know, Shannon, Shannon beats me, probably. she's got the upper hand most of the time. Okay. Strategically. I love that I can go into the workout and kick ass of my husband who is six foot three, two hundred and twenty pounds. Yeah. <laughs> what do they say? <laughs> happy wife, happy life. So Oh, there's nothing better. There's nothing better than, and it doesn't matter if it's by one second or by one rep. A win is a win. <laughs> and if I beat her, 
she's hearing about it. Like I'm texting her on the way out of the gym. I'm following up with her later on in the day, trying to see how's it going. Do, are you planning on going back and trying to beat my score? It is nonstop. There is something special for me to watch Shannon kind of really work at her craft and try to, um, you know, try to achieve personal records for herself. So yeah, it's admirable to see your husband, boyfriend, uh, spouse working out. I've always been impressed with Shannon in terms of her work ethic and her ability to push. CrossFit really challenges you and pushes you to that next level. It's inspiring when I watch Shannon uh, move through a movement or push through something. Right, so to come in and see, you know, Yanni sweating and, you know, maybe missing a lift but then trying again and getting it, it's really amazing. So it's something in their personality that all of a sudden you're attracted to. So not even just watching them do something physically, but the fact that they have that um, determination in them. Uh, but I think one of the things that CrossFit Metric has allowed me to see is kind of Shannon in her element at her best. Uh, it's, it's amazing to see.